Alright, so this afternoon we've got the uh, yelling bulls going to the runoff. We've got uh, four bulls. There's one steer here. And uh, they're gonna go, we're gonna have three going to one place and one going to another. We've got oh, a handful of uh, heifers just on the little lifestyle block. So you can see we've been working up the paddock for the turnips, getting a bit of effluent on the paddock. So we just gotta get that one steer out, he's the back one. So this morning we uh, tail painted, but tomorrow's first day of mating. This girl here's on. She can see the boys over there. But it's actually my brother's cow, that one. So I just brought them down from up the farm. In the, you could say their evening paddock. All right, so this guy's a steer. So he's purely just a freezer beast. So we're going to put him with the uh, cows. He should be all right in there, as long as he doesn't have one testicle up inside. Go and play with the girls. Come on. Come on, girls. Come on. So I've just dropped off um, three short on bulls here. There's one. And there's two at the back. Right, so we've just uh, put three short on bulls in with the heifers. And I've just moved them. There's one, one just there. And then there's those two maroon, red and white ones up there. So, um, yeah, we're not doing A, B on the heifers this year. These ones are actually going off to grazing after labour weekend. And uh, we're going to, we've taken one heifer out of here, which is a contract animal. And we've got her running with the herd. Because uh, we want to inseminate her. LIC is keen on her. Um, we've got a paddock of silage through there, which we cut yesterday. Another one behind the trees. Um, so the plan is that, when these guys go off to grazing, we're going to um, bring the calves down here um, once they're weaned. Over half of them are weaned at home, but we're going to bring them down here. And calves are quite picky, so they're going to eat all the good stuff out of here. And then, uh, you know, so we're going to end up with a lot of stalky stuff. So, an idea that we've had and we're probably going to try is we're going to buy some cheap or underweight um, yearling white face heifers or something like that something of a beef breed and we're going to use it um, use them to tidy up behind so we're looking at getting probably 10 to 15 and if it doesn't work out we'll just flick them off but the plan is just to let them graze behind I don't know how well it's going to work because 10 or 15 in a bigger area you know it's not very concentrated they're still going to pick all the good stuff out so, yeah, I don't know, we'll see how it goes, but that's the plan. But, gee, it's, it's humid today. We haven't had much rain, they've had a good shower here, but we had nothing at home. Because we got silage cut at home this morning. Me and Dad cut um, another lot of silage, we've got six paddocks to do. So, yeah, it's all go. And I'm working on turnips at the moment of working up the ground. So I'm going to head back now and do a bit of work on the uh, fit, get it ready for silage. Been working up the ground with it. Got to go and clean out the second pit with the other tractor. Uh, tomorrow we start AB, so this morning we tail painted. So it's definitely all go at the moment. I find it hard to do videos when you get real busy because you just want to get things done. Don't want to think about having to video 
so that's why you're getting less videos at the moment because we are quite busy even though it's less cows than once a day still keep busy see tail paint painted myself <laughs>